Father, are you okay? Go away, don't touch me. I don't want any favors from you, young lady. Stay away from me. But Dad, please don't say that to me. Look, the baby will be born in a few months and you'll be a grandfather. Don't be angry at me anymore. I hope that both you and your unborn child die. When we first got to Istanbul, you made me promise you something. That I would be strong. And that I would make everyone respect our family. I'm keeping my promise. Everybody who had harmed us is paying for it one by one. the jewelry store that we were always dreaming of, I'm opening one. And in Sadullah's old retail space. <laughs> you really should have seen the look on his face. I enjoyed seeing him like that. He turned purple. Excuse me, mister. Do you have any children? And a wife? No. Oh. But if you don't have a family and children, then you don't have anything at all. Without that, everything's meaningless. Last time you came in here, you said you had tried to commit suicide because you had broken up with your boyfriend. Isn't that right? Yes. However, according to the hospital records right here, it says that there were cuts and bruises all over your body when you went to the hospital. Now, why is that? You committed suicide by cutting your wrist, didn't you? Not by jumping down from somewhere high. Look, I was trying to kill myself because my boyfriend beat me up. All right, you happy now? This has nothing to do with me being happy, little miss. I'm trying to investigate a murder here. If everything that you said is always a lie, it won't be good for you at all. You need to get that through your head. Is that understood? You need to ask that boyfriend of yours to come down here. I'm gonna need to talk to him. What's his name and his surname? You're not gonna get that out of me. Inspector. If you're trying to accuse my client of something, it's her right to know what. Otherwise, it's not proper protocol to go disturbing a young woman's privacy in this manner. Mr. Lawyer, let me decide what is proper protocol and what isn't. How about that, huh? Hmm? Let's take a look at the file here. Daria moved out of her home because she couldn't stand her stepfather's abuses. That's why she left. No matter what you say, we won't accept any accusations regarding my client's involvement in this situation. Whether you decide to accept it or not accept it, what counts here is that I am convinced. I'm going to give you one hour. You need to find a way to get that boyfriend to come down here. He'll testify, granted of course that he actually exists, 